an actual Bosch 2200 is a lot more expensive than most people are willing to actually pay for them. And they're a lot more expensive than you probably paid for your Bosch 2200s. So everybody's hearing the rumor going around that Bosch is discontinuing the 2200s. I'm here to tell you that even if they do discontinue the 2200s, it's not gonna affect you in any way, and I'm gonna prove it to you. So first of all, Bosch will not sell 2200s to performance suppliers directly. Ask me how I know. Second, the cost of those injectors, and I'm only gonna be able to share with you an outdated cost from 2020, but in 2020, those injectors were from 60 to $65 a piece. So if you've been buying those for under $600, like you see a lot of places selling them, there's no profit margin in there for a flow match. There's no margin for, for anything for the person who's selling it to make any money. Another thing, very recently, Bosch has gone to a one-to-one -one exchange program. So anytime we as injector suppliers want to order new 2200s, we have to return an injector core before we can get a new one. So even if they don't discontinue them, which my rep says, hey, I haven't heard anything about it, it's not gonna matter. They're gonna be extremely hard to get if you're not in the fuel injector servicing and rebuilding market specifically. And if you're in the performance market, you're not going to be able to have a contract that gets you both at the same time, both the performance line of injectors like we, like we sell and the 2200, which are a CNG injector meant for forklifts and diesel converted engines, things like that. So is this good news or bad news? On the one hand, all these Bosch 2200s that people have been giving rave reviews about for years seem to be a pretty great injector. On the other hand, an actual Bosch 2200 is a lot more expensive than most people are willing to actually pay for them and they're a lot more expensive than you probably paid for your Bosch 2200s. Let me know what you think.